Look, FedEx supposed to be delivering my plaque today. It was supposed to come four days from now, and they they be acting funny, so I'm leaving their ass a note. Leave hack age. Please. Please. <laughs> how do I put like a like a please? How you how you draw that? That's just put a sad face. <laughs> That weak ass happens. <laughs> I love you. Oh my god. Now, <laughs> welcome to the video. I'm unboxing a new plaque if they deliver it today. One FedEx delivery later. So, look, bro, the FedEx, the guy, he saw my letter and he took a picture. I'm gonna show y'all the picture. Bro, tell him what you just said about that. Hey, man, I saw that shit. I said, damn, I'm getting love out y'all. I felt appreciated. So, I was like, shit, I'm gonna take a picture. I'm gonna show everybody. Like, he could show everybody. <laughs> y'all fuck with me. Follow me on fohbrand.com, man. <laughs> One plaque unboxing later. All right, so we back. Uh, I got the plaque right here. From Jewel Box Platinum. I'm finna unbox this with y'all. I'm gonna get my weapon. I'm gonna rest the ass knife. Ride wave, pray for love. Shit crazy, bro. Yes, sir. So this is just to commemorate my uh, pray for love placement on this album. Um, well, this is the, the album as a whole. The whole album, when it came out, it topped at number two on Billboard. And just because I got a song on the album, I get to get one of these, man. I'm so thankful for this, man, and the rest of these, man. It just, like, it's a good feeling to know that your hard work paying off. Like, I never had trophies or nothing growing up. Like, I didn't play basketball or no football or nothing to get no trophies. So, like, I feel like this this is kind of like what this feel like for me, man. So, yeah. Shout out to everybody on the project. I couldn't have did this without TNT, Kobe. Man, we really made something special. And, hey. Hard work pays off. So yeah, next I'm finna show y'all how to order the plaques. That way when it's time for you to order yours, you already know what to do. But before I do that, I just want to give you a little bit of words of encouragement to go on top of the motivation of, of opening a plaque. Um, I hope y'all take that as motivation because that's what it's for. Bro, you got to stay consistent. I want to encourage you to please stay consistent with anything. It don't got to be beats. It could be working out. It could be going to school. Whatever it is, please stay consistent because it's literally the fucking key. You can do great things, but if you're only doing great things and working hard and being creative and studying your craft one time a month, you're not going to get no fucking work. Man, stay consistent. You never know when the time is going to come. Don't get caught up in Instagram looking at people that you see is successful and compare it to your life and be like, man, that's supposed to be me or it's never going to be me. Don't think like that. Your path is your path. And when it's time for you to go, you need to be prepared. When the opportunity comes, you need to be prepared. So every day you need to be sharpening your skills, maintaining and building healthy relationships, you know what I'm saying? Creating opportunities because when they come and you ready, then that's when you open yourself up for more great things. So I just wanted to encourage y'all to keep going, stay consistent because your time is going to come. But if it, you got to be putting in the work, you're not finna just go to the gym one day and walk out that bitch with a six pack and big arms. Like it's the consistency week after week, month after month and year after year that's going to get you the way you want to be. So, man, I believe in you. I think you can do it. I know you can do it because I did it. And if I can do this shit, anybody can do it. All right, next, I'm going to show you all how to order the plaques. Now, it's, the first thing you got to do is know if you charted on Billboard or if you're gold or if you're platinum or not. Now, ways that you can know if you got on Billboard or if you want platinum or gold, usually just social media. They'll, the artist will post it or somebody on the artist team will post it. If they post a picture, sometimes it looks like this. That's a billboard certification, or sometimes they'll post a platinum certification. 
And these are just examples of what you may see. So if you've been on the album and you see somebody from the team post one of those and you know you worked on the album, you can use that to go get you a plaque. You can't order a gold plaque or a platinum plaque unless the artist has picked out a design. The label and the artist have to sit down and pick out a design that they like, and then you can order one. For the most part, as far as I know, you can't order a plaque that the artist doesn't have. Now, if you somebody that produced a song a long time ago, maybe three, four years ago, a couple years back, and you know you may have charted or you're not sure, the next best thing for you to do is go to Google. Or if somebody didn't post it on social media, go to Google and type in the album. So, for example, I'm going to type in Raw Wave, Pray for Love. Boom. Then what you want to do is scroll down to Wikipedia. Now, this may not be the, the best method, but this is what I did. So, I went to Wikipedia. You go down to a section. Now, this is on most albums. They have a chart section. For most albums, you can get this information probably a month or two after the project album or single drops. So, this little number in the corner right here shows you the date. So, it says April 14, 2020. So next, what you want to do is go to billboard.com and go to that date that you've seen on Wikipedia. Side note about Billboard, their website is really fucking slow. I don't know if it's because they want people to pay for the information, but for the most part, I have a really difficult time navigating Billboard. So if you go through that, just know everybody goes through it also. Okay, now that you're on billboard.com, you want to go to the chart section. If you have a single that you think charted, that's going to be on the Hot 100. The Hot 100 is the top 100 singles. If it's an album that you're looking for, you want to go to the Billboard 200. So you want to click on View Chart and go to the date that you found on Wikipedia. So the week of 14th, they got that information on the 14th. So you want to do this week right here. Click on that. It don't matter which day because they, they take it every week. So you're on the Billboard website and you get to the proper chart. You scroll down until you see the number that you saw on Wikipedia or wherever you got the information from. Click the plus sign, go to share, and copy the link. So then you want to go to jewelboxplatinum.com, and you want to go to order form. This is where everybody orders their plaques from for the most part. Next, you want to fill out the order form. Name, last name, email, phone number, all that. Then it's going to ask you, which project are you interested in purchasing the plaque for? Yes, you have to pay for your own plaques. I know it's stupid and the label should pay for it because you earned it. But, I mean, these people put it together for you. So, I guess you got to pay them for that. And they ship it. You got to pay for shipping too. So, you want to put the artist's name. It could be whoever. The name of the song or the album. Then you scroll down and pick which plaque that you want to get. If it went gold or platinum, you pick RIAA certified. And if it hit billboard, you hit billboard. Or if any of these other things, you can get plaques for all type of stuff. Then you want to scroll down here. It's going to ask you what's your involvement. If you're a producer, you click producer. Now here's where you're going to put that website link at that you got from billboard. You're going to paste the official link from the official website. And then you're going to come down here. Confirm that you're not a robot and then press submit. After that, you just sit back and wait till they email you. You're going to get an email for somebody on the Jewel Box Platinum team, maybe about a week. If they don't email you, call them. But they're going to email you. Even if you call them, they're going to send you an email and they're going to ask for more information. They're going to take your information and they're going to verify it through the record label. If the artist is signed on the label, they're going to verify it through the record label. After the label verifies that you are who you are and you did what you said you did on the album or on the song, Jewelbox Platinum is then going to send you different type of artwork that you can pick from in the pricing. And after that, you pay and then you wait for it to get shipped to your house. Um, every plaque that I got and then took about a month plus to get to me so the wait time has been long so yeah they're not sponsoring this video but shout out to jewel box platinum uh that's currently where i order my plaques at and yeah all right guys that do it for this video if you was motivated by this let me know in the comment section also hit that like button share this video and let me know what you want to see next all right guys